Controversy is mounting over Governor Doug Ducey ordering shipping containers to plug holes in the border wall. Some border town leaders say it's helped stop or slow the record number of migrants crossing into Arizona. The critics, though, call it a stunt which costs taxpayers millions. Our crews witnessed people climbing over and through some of those containers to get into Arizona. And now the Forest Service is out with a warning telling people to avoid that area entirely. That warning pertains to the Coronado National Forest, which runs along southern Arizona. Officials say construction happening along the road has made it unsafe for hunters, hikers, or anyone else to be around. Michael Raimondi is live tonight to explain. Michael. Yeah, the Forest Service says safety is their top priority, and a lot of people have been calling on the governor to stop this container project for now until everything is figured out. And the Forest Service is saying that they didn't even authorize this project. A typically quiet, remote area near the southern border is anything but right now. Their normal, quiet location is not so quiet. You'll find hiking trails and nature as far as you can see. You'll also find containers stacked on top of one another for miles. This isn't the typical sort of desert scene a lot of people picture um, when they picture southern Arizona. Hunters use this land. It's also a place hikers go to for exercise or peace of mind. But now loud trucks and construction are taking over. Bulldozers uprooting trees. Strange sight to see this construction zone. Russ McSpadden documents the work at the border. For the last month, he's gone to this area, and McSpadden doesn't like what he's been seeing. It is a dangerous location. I've seen spools of razor wire just left out on the National Forest. It looks like someone's just dumping junk out in this wild National Forest. The Forest Service says the smaller roads were not meant for the big work happening there. Officials say the roads are being torn up. They're now not as safe to drive on. We just don't want somebody to, you know, stumble upon it not knowing that it's there. Public Affairs Officer Star Farrell says armed security is also out there at times. All these concerns are why they're asking people just to stay away. She doesn't want anyone to get hurt. Public safety is the number one concern. Now, I asked the Forest Service if they can do anything to legally stop this project. They said that they can't comment at this point because of ongoing lawsuits. Meanwhile, Governor Ducey is asking a judge to back him and say that Arizona has the authority over this land, over the federal government. So we'll have to see what happens here in court. As soon as we get any new details on that, we'll be sure to let you know. I'm reporting live in Phoenix tonight. I'm Michael Raimondi for Arizona's Family. I'll send it back to you. All right, sounds good, Michael. Thanks.